an interesting extension of this theme of the, the wolf in the forest was, was um, emerged in a collaborative project that I did with the Boitomelo Women's Group in Hilbra. Um, we dealt with the story of Little Red Riding Hood as a Eurocentric um, heritage but by um, paralleling the African tradition of storytelling, these women were able to take aspects of the tale and put it into their own contemporary experience. And these little red cloaks, they embroidered and made and crocheted for their daughters as a sort of protective symbol against what they saw as the wolf in the forest is the urban threat of the HIV aid, the actual character of the animals. My delight was in their um, fur markings because of the individuality of each animal is marked by their, their fur patination and it's the same for trees and the human form as well. Our fingerprints are our individuality. So it's is a, a sort of an appeal and a celebration of this particular species that's under threat. This um, installation piece is called the Alien Forest and it is a set of five different species arranged in pairs, there are two of them. The underlying concept was the um, biblical reference of the saving of the ark where every animal form went in two by two. So the, um, they're almost three-dimensional drawings and they're obviously remnants of the actual tree form. In both cases of the wild dog and the alien trees in Johannesburg, they are on the extinction list.